Hey yo, what's up? It's Ajit from TME TV, and today I'm going to be reacting to another episode of New Girl. This is going to be season one, episode four, titled Naked. And let's just get right into the video. Scary movie. I hate scary movies. Why are we watching this? We're not watching this, Jess. We're watching it. <laughs> she doesn't like scary movies, but she sure looks interested. <laughs> oh. Mm. <laughs> that guy's gonna blow himself up. <laughs> Why would that guy blow himself up? Sorry, I saw it in the theater. What? <laughs> you know what else we should watch? An American tale. Do you need a list of my sexiest dates, Bob? Jeez, it's been a while for you. You gonna stretch you out? It's not a date, Schmidt. Actually, I don't know what it is. Stretch him out. <laughs> yes, I know, right? Seriously, do you want right. to get dinner? Or no, I know. Sometimes she's so ironic that I think she's being serious. <laughs> Okay, look, you've been out of the game for a while. I have three date packages. They work every time. Package C. <laughs> Close-up magic. You have a D? Fun. I want to talk to you guys about this stuff. Have you been out with anyone since Caroline? Oh. Whoa. Big deal alert. Scary stuff, kids. Yeesh. Duck. This is why I don't talk to you, Jess. Nick, you, you're going to be fine. Don't worry about it. Just, you know, suck in the gut. What gut? The little pooch where you keep your extra cookies. Oh. <laughs> Just cut down on the beer, dude. <laughs> no, it's not. That's not bad at all. Oh, uh, don't tell me he's having. He's gonna start dancing. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> How'd the job interview go? You know, terrible. Did you see the JWoww retweet of the Gaga twit pic? I know Word, and I can open a document, save it, save as, <laughs> print, print preview. She just wanted to chit chat about stuff I've never heard of before. Well, you gotta get up to speed, man. The chit chat is the interview. I have spent the last two years of my life in Latvia. I didn't read the news. Isn't that where the metal ball went? Or am I tripping? In the highlights. Highlight, okay. Uh, country's broke. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Betty White's back. Cool, cool. What about the rest of the Golden Girls? When did she ever leave? They're all dead, man. Yeah, isn't she like a hundred now? Started, man. <laughs> Apparently, she's older than uh, sliced bread. I don't know if that's true or not. Let me know in the comments below if you guys ever heard that. <laughs> hey, Nick, did you turn down that music? Oh, she's definitely walking in. Oh my God. It's like when Pam walks in on Michael. Hey, Nick, <laughs> oh my God! Can I talk to you for a sec? Something's happened. It was no, no. Totally an accident. You can't just Not be telling people this stuff. I just want to. I accidentally saw Nick's pee pee. What? What did she say? I accidentally <laughs> saw Nick's pee pee and his bubbles. <laughs> big deal. Ain't no thing. Ain't no thing. Don't talk about it. <laughs> Oh, that was weird, right? I'm running out the door, Jess. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Pain. <laughs> the pain what I saw. <laughs> Bonjour, le pain. Cool. Have fun on your date. Tell that guy to behave. <laughs> the adventure begins. Okay, excuse me, Jess. <laughs> <laughs> that was so horrible. What am I going to do? He's never going <laughs> to speak to me again. I'm so it's not a big deal. I've seen Nick's stuff like a million times. You have? How? We grew up together. Locker rooms, swimming pools, penis fights. It just happens. What's up? <laughs> Why do you want to? He's my best friend. No one's going to talk about what he just said. <laughs> what if Nick gets into an accident? What if he's horribly disfigured and I have to identify him? I'm standing there and I'm saying, sorry, officer. I can't help you because no, I haven't seen his penis. And then boom, he's buried in an unmarked grave. <laughs> Again, why do you want to see it? Just say when. Just say when. <laughs> Seriously? Are you ser are you serious? Okay, you <laughs> this is impossible. I'm starting over. Schmidt, I need your help. Yo. Okay. <laughs> Alright, just fine. You're a good kisser. 
Can we be, can we be serious? Do you mind Why is she saying it like that? Serious on your face. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, let's not laugh when you're near my penis. Oh, this is definitely getting to him. <laughs> what the hell? Great. Here, do you want me to go first? You're offering just to take your. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at you. Take off your clothes now. <laughs> Bro, she's not gonna laugh. At... Wait, why is your door open though? <laughs> Unless he's in the house. <laughs> Rock Obama, what the? <laughs> yeah, I like him to watch over me. Do you like want to take it slow? <laughs> <laughs> this is nice. Yeah. It's starting. I have something from school that um. You crushed his manhood. <laughs> Why is she gonna pull out some like messed up thing right now? I bet. It's a feeling stick. <laughs> Whoever's holding the feeling stick has permission to say whatever he or she is feeling without being judged. I feel like I want to know what you're feeling. <laughs> Believe it or not, that's not the first time someone's broken my feeling stick. I have a travel size. No. Nick, wait! I'm on Nick with this one. Nick! Did you laugh? Is there something funny about it? No. Beautiful. Stately. A real treat. Oh my god. I think it's great you dance naked to Jamaican music. <laughs> it's really cool. You should explore your sexuality. <laughs> Nick. <laughs> Come on, Nick. I dance naked all the time. We have to talk about this. <laughs> oh. Nick. What kind of elevator does not open when someone's jumping in? Oh, and she's hey, quick. Please talk to me. Jess, there's nothing to talk about. You ruined my date. Every time I tried to take my clothes off, Jess, I heard your little, ha-ha! I just want to have a mature conversation. How can we have a mature conversation when you can't even say the word penis? I can say the word penis. <laughs> say it. <laughs> yeah, yes. Pyrenees. You said pureness. Penis. Not saying <laughs> Not like a ghoul. <laughs> I can say it. Pianist. Oh, you said pianist. Penis pay. Bro, is she like 12? <laughs> not in Swedish. <laughs> not in fake Italian. Pianist. Shut up! <laughs> and then. Ah, Wait, where are they? Why are there lockers and like urinals and stuff? Enough. We're a connect. Get out. Fine. I thought we were best friends. We are. Apparently not. Best friends don't do this, Schmidt. They do it all the time. You laugh? No, I couldn't help it. Did you freak out and make that noise that you always make? What? I don't always make a noise. <laughs> Fine. I guess I missed the moment when everybody got cool about sex. I really messed up. Wait, so did she do that with her boyfriend every time they had sex? I would just make it even. You've seen his, show him yours. This is definitely some, like, friends kind of thing. <laughs> interview did you mess up no i didn't mess up killed it i was amazing at one point i was on the outside of my body watching myself be amazing the woman asked me why i wanted to sell medical supplies i had no answer i've done nothing but play basketball my entire life winston bishop is an american basketball player who played professionally in latvia and he loves ducks winston did you write the part about the ducks i don't even like ducks that much man. oh okay <laughs> You gotta get off Wikipedia, all right? You're going crazy. I was the guy who was good enough to play in Latvia. And then one day, I don't know, man, I just lost it. They found another black guy. Labak <laughs> Melno Virich means the better black guy. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're the best. No, no. I don't know, man. I just don't know what comes next. You know what you do next? Come on. You're gonna get up. Let's get up. Come on, buddy. This feels good. Totally. I love it. What? I've been playing basketball. Why is he running like that? <laughs> what if I was wasting my time? Maybe I should have been figuring out my life like you. Let me figure it out. I'm Schmidt, why is your short so short? <laughs> I got a stupid job. I'm single. My dad won't even let me see his penis. I mean, so my whole life is a sham. Ah. <laughs> I actually feel a lot better. Oh, thanks, Schmidt. Oh. Damn it, Schmidt. What the hell? Schmidt, I hate my life. I hate my life. I'm making new discoveries. I'm a fear-based person, apparently. Stop it, go. I need to call me. Give me a hug, please. Come on, pretty boy. Get up. <laughs> 
Oh my god. So you're, you're like super into cuddling. No, I'm not super into cuddling. I'm just getting out of a relationship and I think I got nervous. I've heard that I'm not great at talking about what I'm feeling all the time. And so I'm sorry about last night. Honesty. I like that. She's definitely gonna expose herself to the wrong person, I have a feeling. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Don't laugh, don't laugh, don't laugh. Just crawl out. I'm totally cool with this. Oh, she's gonna laugh. What are you doing? I'm Jess. Welcome to our home. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> we live in a world with rules. We knock. We have doors. And we knock on those doors. I'm sorry, Nick. Just knock. Nick, I feel... Put that down. Do we have to talk? Nothing to talk about. I feel that Nick is not honoring the feeling stick. I feel me too. <laughs> I feel Schmidt's had a particularly bad day, and I feel that if Nick is truly Schmidt's friend, he would show Schmidt what's in his pants. Oh. <laughs> I feel supported. What is going on with you two? What are you doing? <laughs> I feel Nick Stop it! Bro. <laughs> Yo. I just want to thank you for making me running. <clears throat> Made me feel a lot better. I might not have a job or anything. At least I can run a mile. I've been watching you try to run. Yeah, that was just pathetic. I needed that. I suffer from exercise-induced asthma. You suffer from exercise-induced crying? It's a real thing, man. Okay. DIA. You know what I learned from the internet? We got nothing to worry about. Everybody has their moment. We might get a cat one day. That cat might play the keyboard. A bear might fall on our trampoline. We don't need to have it figured out right now. Our moments will come. <laughs> oh, man. Just keep rolling out. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Come in. Jess, you don't have to knock once you're in the room. Tell that to Michael Scott and Pam. I worked on something for you. <laughs> All right. Peanuts. Very good. <laughs> um, so did Amanda call you back? No, I don't see Amanda calling me back. I'm sorry. It's okay. Maybe you were right. Maybe I'm not ready for meaningless sex with beautiful women. Well, you know, maybe when you are, you'll be able to show her your other peanuts. Your heart peanuts. Get out of my room. <laughs> Hey, um, <laughs> when I was, um, leaving in a hurry, um, did you see everything? Yep. Even my gumbo pot? Ugh, gumbo pot, get out! <laughs> oh, Schmidt's definitely in there. Oh, never mind. I thought he was going to be hiding in the shower. Get out, Schmidt. Oh. Yo, what the hell? <laughs> okay, guys. Well, that was a new girl season one, episode four. And all I can say is Smith, uh, Schmidt, Smith, whatever, man. Ah, uh, you got issues, buddy. <laughs> but yeah, that, that this was just another amazing episode. Once again, I'm really sorry for the long wait. I know it's been like, what, like two months since my last upload, but I'm finally going to be back on the grind. So I'll be definitely pushing out more of these, you know, episodes on a daily basis. Uh, this and Modern Family. Uh, I might even do uh, Kim's Convenience because uh, lately that's been picking up a, a lot of hype, especially with the new release of like the Shang-Chi um, trailer that came out. And apparently... I, everyone from Kim's Convenience is all like Canadian. I'm not sure if you guys know this yet, but I'm I'm, I'm Canadian uh, from Toronto actually, and that's actually where the first uh, Kim Convenience store, or like the main location, is set, or at least shot at. Uh, so that's another you know little sitcom I might be reacting to in the near future. So definitely look out for that. Uh, but thank you guys for making it this far in the video. And don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and notification button. But till next time, peace.